Here's what's new with HDMI 2.0. First, we see an increase in bandwidth from 10 gigabits per second to 18 gigabits per second, meaning you can now send a lot more information down the cable than before. Also, the previous standard was already able to handle 4K, which is four times the clarity of 1080 resolutions. However, it was only able to handle refresh rates of 24, 25, and 30 hertz, but now it will be able to handle 4K at refresh rates of 50 and 60 hertz. It also increased support from the old 8-channel 7.1 surround setup to 32 channels for a more realistic and lifelike surround sound experience, far beyond 7.1 surround sound. Next, it increased the audio sample frequency from 192 kHz to 1536 kHz for higher fidelity, as well as a maximum audio throughput from 36.86 megabits per second to 49.125 megabits per second. This makes it possible to have multi-stream audio for up to four users at once meaning four people are able to hear different audio streams coming out of the same device. Combine this with dual video streams on the same screen and just imagine the possibilities. HDMI 2.0 also supports the 21:9 aspect ratio for theatrical widescreen displays. In addition to that, we get dynamic auto lip sync, which automatically synchronizes video and audio streams to eliminate the need to manually adjust your system for audio delays. It also has additional CEC, or Consumer Electronic Control Extension, meaning you can have more control of your devices with a single remote. While some of these specs are not yet implemented in devices, they open up many possibilities that will benefit not only entertainment but also business and education. And the best part is that HDMI 2.0 does not mean new types of cables or connectors, but refers to the capabilities that devices are now able to have. You can still use the same high speed with Ethernet HDMI cables since they can already handle the increased bandwidth and features. For the best in-home theater equipment, visit SewellDirect.com. SewellDirect.com. Connect anything.